Hello guys, welcome back to another video of mine. This is me flipping windows and I'm going to go ahead and show you guys a new boot animation that I've just discovered right now. I was reading a news article and all of a sudden I came up on this boot animation that this uh, person just came out with. And this was just after the fact that I saw the Hacker 0007 do a overview on a boot animation. So here's my boot animation that I'm going to show you guys. Not that one, but this one right here. There we go. That's pretty fluid. And there's a blue one, a green one, and an orange one. Yeah, and that's it. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys right now on how to go ahead and apply it. So hold on. Okay, so inside the boot animation folder that you'll get, or the zip folder, all you have to do is just open it and click on here by right clicking on it and running as administrator. This will come up. If you have an already boot animation that you've already applied, always make sure that you go over here and press restore backups. Otherwise it won't work. But if you have not done this ever before, go ahead and do this. All you have to do before I do this, hold on. All right, all you have to do is click on file, load boot skin and where the folder is go ahead and click on there and just select the one that you want so if you have a wide screen you want to go 16 by 9 if you have a 1024 by 768 screen uh, that looks like a big old square you want to go ahead and do the 4 by 3 so I'm gonna go ahead and do the wide screen 16 by 9 press open and then I'll go ahead and play it just to make sure if you want to go ahead and change the name of here go ahead and do so I'll go ahead and click and change this by pressing Windows, flipping Windows, and then the message to. And I could say, I don't know, uh, launching Asus. There we go. And then press apply. And that'll go ahead and take effect. And there, we should be successful. If it gives you an error, just let me know. Go ahead and leave a comment for any errors that you come up with but be sure if you already have one be sure to restore backups if before you change to another one all right take care guys bye